A couple hundred people weren't outside enjoying the longer evening of daylight savings time Monday. They were hard at work as the sun set on Safeway's long association with the Garden City. At 6 p.m., Safeway closed forever on reserve. Crews had 12 hours to change over to the new Missoula Fresh Market. Setting up each department, all the all the fixtures, all the signs, the tags, the um, figuring out which warehouse product comes from, where it's going to go, what days it's coming, which trucks it's coming on. A small army fanned out identifying some 50,000 items, changing Safeway price codes and labels with Fresh Markets info. Almost all the Safeway crew is staying so they knew their way around, but it's still a mammoth task. On a hot summer day, this would be the job to have, but tonight it's just a lot of hard work, remarking thousands of items in the frozen food cases. Local vendors and suppliers like these cheese guys were brought in to sort out specialty products, but it was about more than tagging food. Yeah, tonight's all about getting all of Safeway's equipment out of here, all of their hardware, all the computers, all of their networks, all the different things that make a beast like this go. And then um, we're installing ours alongside at the same time. The changeover represents more than new prices and systems. Holtet and partner Ron Ramsbacher plan a new locally oriented approach. We'll go from the corporate side that had a lot of uh, corporate brands and they had, a, you know, the name brands. Well, we'll have the name brands and we'll also have a, a corporate brand, but we'll also carry the Montana made and a much more local and individual, individual products. Our pricing isn't going to be buy three, get two, or buy five, get one, or any of that. It's going to be straightforward. This is how much this costs, and it's the same price for everybody that walks in the door. No more gimmicks and games. In Missoula, Dennis Bragg, MTN News.